Hello, my name is Daniel Lynn. I'm a maths teacher. I've been teaching maths for well over 10 years. I've also been a head of year and I know exactly how difficult maths can be for children and how demoralising it can be when they can't do it. I've also done a lot of work with primary school and I know with this new GCSE from a few years ago, it's much more challenging. And a lot of these kind of changes and foundations need to be laid from an early age. So I've been for the past uh, couple of years trying to help parents around the country to help their children basically, to give them things that they need to be doing to encourage their learning, their problem solving, so that ultimately they can achieve a good GCSE result. Over the, uh, the lockdown period, I've been putting on some three GCSE lessons, some three Key Stage 3, Key Stage 2 and Key Stage 1 lessons over Facebook. Uh, they're all completely free, I'm just trying to help out as a teacher. My college is closed and I feel that everyone, whatever the circumstances, should be entitled to a free mathematical education. So I've been putting these on uh, along with my hats and uh, they've gone down quite well, but to improve the quality of these and from listening to your feedback from the people who've been watching, uh, I am trying to improve everything by going onto YouTube. Mainly the picture quality should be much better and the sound should be better as well. So here I am, I'm on YouTube, I'm listening to your uh, comments you said. We're going to have some great lessons coming up next week and weeks after that until the schools reopen. So please uh, tune in to the lessons, sign up to the everything on Facebook, it's all free. There's loads of stuff for you to be getting into. Just to give you a taster, I've got a little puzzle for you and uh, please I'll put a chat up on, uh, on Facebook to see if you answers for this. So the challenge is, how can you make a total of 12 using three identical digits in a simple addition sum? Now you're probably thinking of four, because four plus four plus four is 12. However, you are not allowed to use a digit four. So how can it be done? So that is your challenge for you. Okay, good luck and uh, Ideally, if you can subscribe to the YouTube channel, then you'll get all the updates and everything, and then you'll know when I go live. All my lessons are at 10 o'clock. The lessons will be on Monday, GCSE and Key Stage 3. On Tuesday, we're looking at Key Stage 1. And on Thursdays, we are looking at Key Stage 2. Those lessons are live from 10 o'clock. You can always watch them later, of course, but we do play bingo, which is much better live, and everyone loves that. So, I hopefully see you soon. Goodbye.